In continuing our development of this strategic framework, Sentinel-9, we can reflect on the session we had on strategy, strategic decision making, the session we had on dichotomy of the variables used in the strategic decision making. We call them flow variables and stock variable and the relationship between them. We can um, uh, look at what we covered before the break in terms of um, coordination games and cooperative games. And in this session, let's just bring these topics into what I would like to refer to as, an, as two axioms. Further from this, we, now go, we, we will go on to have a look at application of these concepts and these axioms into business, into commerce. We'll translate this into uh, areas where are specifically related to business. At this stage, we are still developing these conceptual frameworks to apply later. Okay, the first one I would like to share with you is the axiom of flow variables, intuitive thinking, and coordination games together. Now you can put this back to front, it doesn't matter. For the purpose of the exercise, I would say flow variables, intuitive, fast thinking, as the literature puts it. People have brought this up, they've actually won the Nobel Prize in terms of different modes of thinking for different activities. So it's a well-established concept. We're just using it to plug into our theoretical framework. Uh, in the book that uh, is published, these are properly referenced. Flow variables, intuitive thinking, coordination games. Asymmetric positioning, fast thinking, variables that provide flow. The next axiom, next to it, builds up on the second set of parallel definitions we had in those sessions. If these things iterate fast, uh, repeatedly, we will have resolution to a cooperative game based on slow, rigorous thinking, which creates a stock variable. A stock variable could be something that is very difficult to attain unless a certain period of time, time, time has passed cannot be attained quickly. Brand name, trust, competitive advantage of that sort takes time. It takes repetition. It requires resolution of a cooperative game, which requires iteration. It requires slow thinking, analytical application. Where does this come from? From the application of flow variables, intuitive fast thinking, coordination games. So in a business, for instance, management process is very much associated with axiom number one, efficiency. How do we do things right? Leadership, directors, directorship is more associated with axiom number two. Where do we go? What do we create? Strategic thinking, management. They both need each other. Without one, the other one is malfunctioning. In fact, if you don't have one, the other one can be more harmful, even if it's efficient. So these two axioms that is depicted here are essential in forming a theoretical framework that will help us to see how strategic thinking, strategic application of thought process in business can create efficiency, effectiveness, management, directorship, vision, mission, operational efficiency, competitive advantage, proper return on capital, Extraordinary abnormal return to capital, which we cover, that's called wealth. 